Hello everyone, welcome to my channel English Learning. Today we are going to do an essay on Makar Sankranti. If you want to write a paragraph on Makar Sankranti, you can take out some important lines from this essay. ठीक है? Essay और paragraph में क्या difference होता है कि वही essay जो है हम डिफरेंट डिफरेंट पैराग्राफ्स में हम लिख सकते हैं इट मे बी ऑफ टू पैराग्राफ्स थ्री पैराग्राफ्स बट पैराग्राफ में क्या होता है हम एक पैराग्राफ ही बनाते हैं उसमें अलग अलग से हम नहीं लिखते हैं एक पैराग्राफ ही फॉर्म में लिखते हैं लेकिन ऐसे को हम अलग अलग पैराग्राफ्स में लिख सकते हैं अगर आपको पैराग्राफ लिखना है तो यहाँ से आप इम्पोर्टेंट पॉइंट्स उठाकर एक पैराग्राफ में लिख सकते हैं ओके सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट India is a country with numerous festivals having different cultural, religious and historical significance. Makar Sankranti is one such festivals with an important cultural background. Though it is a seasonal festival, more specifically a harvest festival, people worship god Dharma thereby elevating it to a religious level as well. Every year on the 14th of January we celebrate Makar Sankranti. This festival is celebrated to mark the end of winter and welcome a new harvest season. The astral and religious significance of Makar Sankranti. According to Hindu religion, Makar Sankranti festival is dedicated to the sun lord. It is considered to be an auspicious day because of its astrological significance. According to the Indian astrology, Makar Sankranti is a specific solar day that marks the entry of the sun into the zodiac of Makar or Capricorn. This day also marks the end of winter months in India. After this day the short winter days start to become longer and the long winter nights start to become shorter another important significance of this day is that it is the last day of the month of po or posh and it is followed by the beginning of the month of magha according to the indian calendar to coincide with the revolutionary movement of the earth with respect to the sun the day of makar sankranti is deferred by one whole day after 80 days it is observed that after the day of makar sankranti the sun starts its movement towards the north this movement is also known as uttrayan it is for this reason that this day is also known as uttrayan now move to its cultural significance Makar Sankranti is a part of our cultural heritage the roots of which go deep into Indian mythology according to it there once lived a powerful god named Sankranti he defeated a demon named Sankrasura to commemorate this win Makar Sankranti is celebrated it is also believed that on the next day of Makar Sankranti the deity killed another demon named Kinkarasur This day is also celebrated as Kinkrant. One can find the mention of the Makar Sankranti in Punjab, the Hindu almanac. This almanac gives information on the clothing is form, direction as well as the movement of Sankranti. Let's learn about its celebration. In Uttar Pradesh this day is celebrated as the festival of donation or khichdi people fast on this day and eat and offer khichdi to as part of the celebrations in Bihar also the day is celebrated with khichdi donation of urad rice gold clothing and other items are also an important part of the celebrations in maharashtra married women celebrate this auspicious day by donating cotton oil and salt to other married women in bengal people donate the same after taking a bath there is also a huge fair of makar sankranti at gangeshwar every year people make special sweet meats called pithe with rice flour coconut and jaggery in tamil nadu this day is celebrated as pongal however pongal celebrations continue for four days in this region gujarat has a vivesia celebration of kite festival on this day in punjab and haryana this day is celebrated as lohri 
people gather around a bonfire and dance while throwing puffed rice and popcorn into the fire conclusion thus makar sankranti is celebrated with a joyous mood across the country the movement of planets around the sun heralds the onset of this festival which is an integral part of the indian culture so this was all about makar sankranti sc if you want to write a paragraph you can select out some important lines from this sc so please like the video share it and subscribe my channel thank you bye bye